friend. I'm very glad you're here. This part of the forest is where Pooh and his friends gather to decide what they'd most like to do. Shall we join them for a game? And now we shall go to my house to find some opposites. Opposites are most everywhere, if only we know where to look. They are? Yes, Pooh Bear. They are. Why, your own house is full of opposites. It is? It is indeed. Shall we learn more about them? I think I should like that very much. Won't you please come in? Move the arrow here and there and see how many opposites you might find. One can of milk is big, while the other is utterly small. Oh! This side is the back, while the other is the front. The honey pot is in the clock, and out, in, and out, and in again. Which can only mean it's time for honey. The curtains are shut now, but when they're not, they're open. Rue is really rather dirty at the moment. Oh, Rue dear, just look at yourself. And now he's nice and clean. Oh my! Up and down, up and down, and up again. All this upping ooh, makes me want to sit down and go. Oh. The candle is unlit, but look, it's lighting. Now it's lit. The candle is now, but now it's unlit. The opposite of full is empty, which is what my tummy is. Time for something sweet. Tigger is in front of Piglet, who's hiding behind Tigger. Tigger is tall, little Roo's a bit short. Hello, and goodbye too. Tigger's more hot than not. Now he's feeling frozen and cold. Poor Eeyore is wet, but once the wind blows, he's nice and dry. It appears my friends have found some opposites too. Hello. If someone is not near, hello, he's likely to be far. <laughs> opposites are everywhere. They're right where you live, too. Perhaps you'll look for some of your own until we're together again. 